Hello all, in today's video we will see what is arithmetic mean and I will also explain the importance of mean, median and mode in the field of data science. Notes for the video have been provided in the download link below. In the previous video we had seen that the five most commonly used averages or measures of central tendency are arithmetic mean, geometric mean, harmonic mean, median and mode. In today's video we will see what is arithmetic mean. Before starting with arithmetic mean, we should know that mean, median and mode are going to play a very important role in data science. Hence, I will highlight its importance before we move ahead. Firstly, it is used in descriptive analysis. What is descriptive analysis? Descriptive analysis means organizing and summarizing the data in a way that makes it easier to understand. Then all the three mean, median and mode will be used for handling missing values during data cleaning. Mean provides an overall average and whenever there are number of outliers, we will be using median. Remember, whenever there are outliers, we will use median. This is a favorite interview question. And mode will be used mostly in case of categorical data. Now coming to arithmetic mean. Arithmetic mean of observations for an ungrouped data is given by x bar equals to sum of all values upon number of observation. Arithmetic mean for a group distribution is given by x bar is equal to 1 upon summation of all the frequencies into summation of product of frequency and the variable xi. If xi is a single class then xi represents that class. However, in case xi is a class interval then the midpoint of the class interval is taken as xi. Let us now understand this with a, with the, with a small example. So here the midpoint of the first class will be 27.5 and the product of frequency and midpoint will be 275. Similarly, we will get all other values. Now getting the summation of frequency into the midpoint will be 4165. So directly substituting these values in the formula will get the arithmetic mean as 41.65. If the values of x or frequency are large then the arithmetic mean x bar is calculated using the formula x bar is equal to a plus h upon n into summation of fi di where a is the arbitrary point. Most of the time the value of a is the value of x corresponding to the middle part of the distribution. D is the deviation given by x minus a upon h where h is the class width. Now let us understand this by taking a small example. Here the value of a will be the value of x corresponding to the middle part of the distribution that is 42 and the class width will be 30 minus 25 that is 5. So we get the value of deviation as minus 2.9 and the product of deviation and the frequency will be minus 29. Similarly, we will get all other values and the summation of f into d will be minus 7. So, replacing all these values in the formula, we will get the value of arithmetic mean as 41.65. I hope the concept of arithmetic mean is clear by now. That's all for today. In the next video, we will see the first property of arithmetic mean. Thank you.